Hey, good morning, everybody. Hope you're having a nice uh, Easter weekend. Today is Saturday, day before Easter. And I stopped by my local Walmart a couple days ago up here on Vancouver Island and found these blaster or blister packs, sorry, um, with one of my favorite uh, packs in there, these hobby packs of 2021 uh, Topps Chrome. I just love those cards. So I, I bought three of those and then uh, I bought two of the 2021 Topps Chrome NPB uh, uh, series of blister packs with uh, those packs inside. We're hoping to get a uh, Yoshinobu Yamamoto in that he's card number 90 so we'll see that'd be kind of neat but i also like uh i think these may be series two 2022 I'm thinking the second pack and uh that would be where we can try to get a um short print of uh Julio Rodriguez. I'm guessing. I think it's series two. These I think are twenty. These are like the different series, the the second pack. So I'm not. They're tops, but I'm not even going to worry about those. So, anyways, let's save these for last. We'll open up. It's going to be a little bit. Because I've got two packs in here, so it could be a little bit of a longer video. I'll try not to be. Let's see if I was correct on this guess. And it is 22, 2022 Series 2. So that's always a chance of getting a uh, Julio Rodriguez out of there. Uh, short print. I've seen so many people get that short print. And I just had no luck at all. There's another one. So let's open these up first. Let me get that out of the way. See if we get that card number 90. I usually don't, uh, I don't collect this series. Um, the main reason I got it was because I wanted the uh, Series 2 from 2022. But with Yamamoto making a, making a, or getting signed by the Dodgers and making a big splash. Well, see how big a splash it really was. So that is, well, that was, and it got these are hard to read but they're nice chrome cards that's number 111 I don't know any of these others but they're nice cards there's a green in there we can see that coming up and uh, what what uh, let me take a look at this he was on the buffaloes so that might be helpful too seeing what there's a nice uh kind of a rainbow there's an american playing over there uh, boy that was card 180 all right and there's the lions team again i don't know any of these, I'm just hoping to get the Yamamoto. Wouldn't it be nice if it was a green? It's not. That's a nice card. That is numbered out of 99. And, oop, go ahead, drop the card, Tim. It's numbered out of 99. Let me get my trusty card savers here. So again, you can see that's 48 out of 99. And none of these other ones are numbered. Just take a quick peek to make sure. And they are not. But that was kind of neat. So we have two of these. I'm gonna, and I've got one, one more in here. I was, these were the only ones left that, uh, 
at least that day, that had the Series 2 from 2022. Go ahead and open this one. That is 2022 update. That's kind of what I thought, but I wasn't sure. I don't really think there's much in that update. But we'll open it up to see what happens. So we're going to open the Series 2 up last. We'll open the uh, Topps Chrome up second to last. And we'll just get these two out. See if I can find the best card in each one of these. And, oh, it's like, well, that one might be a Chrome. It's, it's, I'm looking at the bottom. It was a Stars of MLB, which I do not like. But uh, I do hold on to the uh, Chrome one. So let's see what happens here. Let's see this update. Oh, there's a Spencer Torkelson rookie. That's pretty nice. I mean, it, it's nice. Say hi, Suzuki. Uh, let me see something here. Yeah, he had a card in that uh, uh, Japanese pack, too. That's a nice card. Hmm. I hate that other year. 20, I hate 20, some of the 2021s because of not being able to read the darn names on there. So there's a Jose Miranda Generations card. Just an insert. Stars of MLB. Rookie card. Jaron Duran. That's just plain. It's not a chrome. Now that, I, now that I've seen that, I don't think the other one's going to be a chrome either. Oops. Should put those there. <clears throat> oh, let's see. Nothing. Dustin May. I wonder if he's going to be pitching this year after his surgery. Oh, that is a Topps Chrome one. So that's pretty nice. Here's a regular. Hunter Green Rookie. That's pretty nice. And oh, look at that. Oh, it's not a chrome. I thought it was. Oh, wait a minute. The other one was. So I don't like Stars of MLB except if they're a real nice rookie card like that. And then I do like the chromes. So that's nice. Hunter Green. And uh, where did I put the others here? There's this. There's that Sai Suzuki and Spencer Torkelson. That's a rookie debut. Not quite as valuable as the others. So I don't know. Might be the Julio Rodriguez, which is always a nice card. Might be the best one out of that. You guys can let me know. So we'll put that one on top for now. Bring these a little closer. All right. So then we're going to do these three packs of uh, 2021 Topps Chrome. talks to himself a lot. There is nothing wrong with talking to oneself. The problem is when you start <laughs> answering yourself and having a full conversation. 
Ozzy Albies, that's a nice card. Willie McCovey, Taylor Jones, rookie. Oops, oh, that's a nice card. Clark Schmidt, rookie card. For, I forget what that insert or that finishes on that, but it's really nice. Victor Robles, Tyson Miller. There's a refractor. Gasmani Grandal. Jorge Alfaro. Ketel Marte. Gary Sanchez. And there's another one. Zach Polensk. Palsek. So I don't know. Are black and white, black and white mini diamond. That might be what that is, possibly. So there was nothing of any huge importance there, but oh, yeah, I think that's the black and white mini diamond. We'll just put that one on top for now. Say that was probably one of the better, if not the best cards. Now, let's see if we can. Pull something nice out of these. 2022. Series 2. Let's try to get a nice short print out of here. Oh, God, I'd love to get a Julio Rodriguez. I did pull out of a hobby box when, I first, when they first came out a... Uh, Shohei Otani short print, so that might be worth something. All about the short prints right now. Don Mattingly. That, I think, might be a short print. Since we got time, I'm going to check that. That is card number So I think that's let's see here. I think that is a short print. So variation code on the back. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm taking so long. I'm trying to find it here. Okay, 4.45, Don Mattingly, it is. That's what I thought. That's a very nice short print. So that's gonna be, out of a blister pack, that's gonna be the best card so far. There's Joey Votto. Oh, well, I don't mind dropping those. Berto Perez, the wife is coming home. I can hear the door open. Yeah, garage door is closing. Can't remember the other short print rookie. Is it Torkos? Torkos. Nice, like a Walmart blue, Jackie Bradley Jr. Not a rookie, that's nice. There's another insert, Aaron Judge. Scars of MLB Chrome. Nope, not a Chrome, Max Muncy. Okay, so last pack. Yep, I heard the door open and there's the dog and then the wife should be following soon after. 
try to get these things done before they get home. I'm glad they had that card turned over, so at least I knew. There's another one. This one's numbered, wow, out of 76. Antonio Senzatella. Oh, look at that. It's a uh, uh, Independence Day, I believe, 76. That is nice. Holy cow. Nine out of 76. Well, this was uh, not Mitch Hanninger. Stars of MLB, and then I doubt there's anything in here. So, I'll tell you what. Those were pretty good. Uh, these Series 2 packs were excellent, actually. And, uh, based off of that, let's just move these here. I got two great cards out of that one. A Independence Day and a Don Mattingly short print. Those were perfect. I'm I'm happy. <clears throat> you, you just never know what you get out of those, but those blister packs, that ended up being pretty darn good, especially the series 2 from 2022. Um I'm I'm happy. Julio Rodriguez, rookie, even though it's the Stars of MLB. Still a rookie. Uh, very happy. So let me know what you thought. Uh, really appreciate your comments. I really appreciate everybody who's been a subscriber. And to thank those who are my subscribers, as uh, many of you know, I do a series that's called uh, Everybody Wins the Giveaway. So everybody who participates in that giveaway ends up with a card that's shipped to them for free. You don't have to pay anything to enter. Uh, and the cards are always going to be an a, uh, autograph or a relic, sometimes maybe an auto relic. But it's always going to be one of those hits. And I've been doing that for a couple years now. And really, I enjoy it because I like saying thank you to people who uh, do support me. And everybody else that seems to be getting a card enjoys it as well. So you've got to be sub publicly subscribed to my channel. And then when I post a video for that giveaway, you've got to make a comment on it. So uh, probably uh, at the end of April, I think. I'm gathering cards uh, for the giveaway. So I think the end of April is when I'll go ahead and do one. So again, anyways, let me know what you think about the cards, uh, about the break. And uh, these are two nice hits right there. I'm, I'm very happy. Have a great rest of your weekend. Hope you really have an, enjoy yourselves and uh, have a great Easter tomorrow. Thanks for watching.